Yeah, hello and welcome to another episode of Life Talks with Ayo Fowley. We have the voice behind the camera. <laughs> we have the wizard. <laughs> and we have propane in the studio. Come on, my G. Come on, brother. Don't know. Come on, brother. Three, come on, done though. Welcome, 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 welcome. welcome. Time, good though. Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm yeah, good. Man. I feel that that slap through that thing up nice, like your thing fill up. What do you mean? Your what's that string on your on your neck there? The other one, yeah. <laughs> you slap me. You slap me so hard. You slap me so hard. The thing went up, cause well, it's, the string's on me today, isn't it? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Actually, you know what I'm saying the come on. on me today. Come I gotta watch the strings. You know what I'm saying? Oh, no, it's all good. What's good? No nah, man, can't complain. I'm living. I'm breathing. I'm saying it's nice. Healthy, I'm good good. God, God, yeah. It's yeah. nice to have you in front of me. No, nah, thank you, brother. It's been big time. How much time I see you? How much yeah, time yeah. I've seen my brother? And how much time I've asked you for his number? Yeah, 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 <laughs> like yeah. multiple times to get yeah. you. Oh, mate, it's been a long, long, long time coming. Yeah, yeah. Like it's nice to have you sitting in front of me. Nah, thank you, brother. I appreciate yeah, it, man. I Blessings. appreciate you. Oh, cool. Blessings, man. Appreciate you. Bro, where, 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 we, where can we start? Gotta talk. Let me let you talk. I talk to you about sometime. Start, man. Well, this isn't. This can, for, I think everyone usually comes at him for music, yeah. Yeah. So that's what he's used to. But like, yeah, I feel start, like, start with wherever. I'm, I'm good still. I'm not gonna give out your government, but you, yeah. even though you do on your some of your tunes, I'm, yeah. I'm not gonna say it now. But yeah. I want more of that guy's story. I think that's what life talks is about. Yeah. So, so now, so get with it, man. You know what I mean? Cool. Cool. So, so who are you? Who, what was um, it like? What was it like as a child? Like, so where was like as a child? Like girls, that's a, that's that's where it would start. Like when I was like a child, like I'm I'm I was, I was born in Congo, like so. Okay, so I didn't even know he's Congolese, you know. Yeah, yeah, I'm quite, big yeah. up, big up. No, I think big up my Congolese people as well. Big up. Um, so like um, coming as a child is a bit different, if that makes sense. Being as a child, a bit more di- yeah. different, like so. Like I came in, I was about I think four or five or something like that. Okay, and um, closer to the back, so. I was like four or five or something like that. So um, I was just, I was like I was like me and mum rolling. Like I was a kid that used to roll my mum. Just me and her, and um, I think we used to we used to live in that two in first. Do you remember Congo? Yeah, roughly though, not yeah. fully. Do you know what I mean? But roughly, I can remember it still. So, and then yeah, so then we've moved down to like Finn, like Holloway, like times. So I was that kid that um, I'm just at these times. I'm just observing. I'm in London, isn't it? Like I'm in the UK. Like you're four when you come over. Yeah, four. So these times when I moved to when I'm in like North London, I must be like five, six. Okay, like. you went south and then come to North. London. Yeah. Okay. That's like, yeah, yeah. Them sort of times. So I'm just reflecting right now. I don't know, like, I don't know. The big shift. Yeah, like I'm used to like being the kid that can run around and do whatever I can do because that's like where I'm from. It's like it's our mm. it's our part. You know what I mean? So like, um, I'm just observing and trying to find out what actually goes on in this part of the, um, the, uh, the world. You know what I mean? So. Yeah, I was just that kid, just, 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 just eyes open. I was kind of quiet a bit mm. until, yeah, got a bit old. But I was, I was always like a, um, a smart kid. Do you know what I mean? I always mm. like, um, I liked maths a lot because of my mum. Mm. So yeah, Why? that was. She, she was good at maths. Yeah. Yeah, she was good at maths, and um, and she was always big on me, like knowing maths and English. Okay. So like, um, from a yeah. young age, you're good. Pardon? So you're, 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 you're yeah, but but I was I was a kid that that kind of like only figured out I was smart years later on, because because okay. like I started becoming a bit troublesome and whatnot. You kind of like you don't really focus on your education as much. Mm. Do you know what I mean? So, but yeah, like, I was the kid that was smart because uh, I knew it. Do you know what I'm saying? But sometimes, see, even with music, when you like know or something, or you're good or anything like that, mm. you can do it whenever you want. Sorry, you put a kid wherever you want. Yeah, yeah. You get, you want. You get cocky when or... when you're ready. Okay, that makes sense because you feel like you're good at certain things. Yeah. You know what okay. I'm saying? But like, yeah. So that's okay. Just, yeah. Yeah. So what? So as a, as a child now, mm. so you're saying you was focused. You was watching, but that being displaced <clears throat> from Congo coming here, yeah, that was a lot to 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 port you still. Yeah. So you would be like like. Yeah. Feel that way still. How did you get into like what you got into? Where you said you was getting into the wrong things, basically. Um, Do you think that was like distraction or the, the, the that same kind of thing? The comfortability, thinking, okay, you know what, I can pick up the book when I want to pick up the book, so I can fuck up out a bit now, or, you know? Yeah or no? Because see, something like I said, observing. So, as like a kid, right? You observe and you copy. 
and sometimes it's your environment, sometimes it's your household. So growing up, right, um, like I might have not had like obviously my mum ended up getting married, what not to some to to, to, um, to her husband, what not, not they 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 together no more. But at the time, like I don't know, I just, I just, just like a household, I didn't really feel it. Do you know what I mean? Mm. How long was it with you and your mum till she even got with someone? Till about I must have been like seven. Okay, so yeah, till yeah. about seven. Mm. Just you or any siblings? I got I got siblings on my on my dad's side. He's there in Congo and all that. But my mum, I'm I'm the first child. Yeah. So we were just rolling me and mum. So then this guy comes in. I don't see this guy because he's, he's my sister's he's my sister's father. I'm not trying. That's, to, that's yeah. how the child's seeing it. I don't think yeah. you're speaking from your perspective. No, today. no, because see, see when I was like bit, when I was, from the child. When yeah. I was a bit more younger, I was a bit more like hurt by certain things. So even how I describe situations, I might break it down in a bit more. But no, I'm, but it's good because you're talking yeah. from the child at the time, I believe. Yeah. So, but as I've, as I've got older, they're still my sisters, and I still got. To, I'm saying show their fathers a bit, a bit of respect. You know what I'm saying? Just because their fathers, you know what I'm saying? Just on that level. So no, definitely, definitely. Yeah. So like I said, I was just that little kid, my mum, and this guy comes in or whatnot, and then um, I don't. Know, I just felt like um. That's when things change for me. Because my mind you don't when you're talking, yeah, mind you don't talk away from the mic. Yeah. That's all. Cause I'll lose you when you come forward. I'll just pull the I mic. I feel like forward. that's when things changed a bit. Like um I started coming a bit more troublesome. Mm. And it was only like until I studied psychology, like years later, I realised, wait, 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 he wasn't really troublesome. He, he might have been, mm. but this thing came from somewhere. He's reacting. We can um you was the yeah yeah it was the father Kate of your somewhere. sister sister was your the you know what I'm trying to say yeah <clears throat> sorry excuse me yeah was he was he nice was he a good guy was he not nice to you did you feel she wasn't pleasant if that makes sense on top of like on top of coming because as a child someone coming in and breaking that dynamic anyway because it's just you and your mum they would have been that yeah to she be wasn't up, pleasant to, you know what I mean yeah so he wasn't nice as well nah so you 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 learn to adapt to that innit? And and when you adapt, you have to, but yeah, you, 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 and that's you what I said. To, like, yeah. As a kid, you're you're just you're just um, you're just what's the word called? I'm just observing. So if this is what's the norm or whatnot, I might start picking up that attitude too. And that's when I start might bringing it to school and like outside. Mm. And that's it, kind of like you know what I mean. But like even just during them times, as because well, like I used to go to church. Like I'm black. Like, what kind of um religion? What kind of um 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 my mom, oh. Christian. Christian. There's but there's you know that there's so much um Bible or so much Bible, teaching. So much divisions that, that Okay, we're in yeah, the church. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you have uh contact with your dad? Yeah, at the time, yeah and no. Let me not say yeah and no, yeah. But I just wasn't respecting it like. I'd be real like mm. I'm saying that because where, 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 where he was yeah where he was no, you, you, you had to do real. what you had to do because basically what, yeah. what you was living yeah. he couldn't save you from it or help you no. out where he was it's just on the end of the phone it's your reality for you like you yeah. said you had to you had to live it like I said it's bad but you said you had to live it yeah. so, and I'm so, just chatting to him I'm like okay <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah you like you know what I'm saying certain for them I need you for that mm. you know what I'm saying and as I got older I realised like because um, I might have held certain emotions towards it and all that but as I got older, I realised, like, he never really done anything bad. You know what I'm saying? He just, certain situations wasn't, wasn't, um, Who's proper. My, my father, yeah. No, my, my, my father. Because yeah. otherwise, he would have been there. You know what I'm saying? But, like, you can't blame everything on him. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know yeah, yeah. You just got to understand how life goes on. But, yeah, at the time, like, might have been speaking, but I wasn't really, like, too, like, into or interested in yeah. Yeah. You know what I mean? Because even now, the fact, like, even for me, looking into that, if he was like older, the fact that you had even contact with him could have helped a little bit if you was into it, if you had the comprehension yeah. into it. Do you know yeah, what I mean? I, I just, I just never like. I'm like, where are you like? Yeah, yeah. I need my father's head. You know what I yeah. mean? Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. I understand. You know I mean? Yeah. How old is you? I'm like, like seven, eight. Seven, eight. Seven, eight. Yeah. I'm still, I'm still born. I was eight. Yeah, I was eight. I was still born. So. And you started acting up. How did you like? You know, like. I was, I, anyway, let me not talk about me. Let me talk about you. Yeah, just yeah. in school, like just suspensions and all that. And what fighting? What kind of um, thing? Just, just, I was just, I don't know, I was just troublesome. Like I don't, know, I wouldn't say like I was. Yeah, I was troublesome getting suspended and certain things. Like, not too much fights, just more times maybe just badness. Like do you know what I'm saying? Mm. I don't know. Yeah, because it wasn't. I wasn't really like no. I wasn't like some violent kid having bare fights and all that. I wasn't. Mm. Like, like just getting mischievous and mm. 
getting caught for dumb stuff and mm. bunking and you know what I mean? So yeah. He's pissed, angry maybe. Yeah. 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 Oh, good. Yeah, no, I hear that man. I hear that. It's a lot. It's a lot. Propane. My brother. Propane. Come on, bro. See it in front of me. The man in front of me is a serious yeah, guy. Come on. Building, come on. Building, come on. Like I'm saying, the amount of times we try to get together and I've seen you like But it's only right though, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying time time is perfect. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. And you know what I'm saying? I remember like we shout out to Jay like and he was saying like oh go on like because he thought I was he, I don't know he might have thought I went on it. I just was, but it's maybe maybe might have been timing. And I think during the time there I was yeah. just, just getting back into uni as well. So yeah. it was like um you know what I'm saying? But yeah man. I'm glad to be here in this from the end, man. I gotta support this, you know what I mean? Yeah. It's I'm, right. Mm, no, I'm glad to have I'm you right. here. I'm glad to have yeah. you here. Yeah, you're from the ends, but your family too. Yeah. <clears throat> you got a strong voice. You're a big man still. Mm. Like, you know what I mean? You're shorter than me. I'll throw it out there, but your stature is strong and big and tall. Do you get what I'm saying? When I talk to you, I look, we eyeball each other as far as I'm concerned. You get me? Sure, yeah, come on. Come on, I'm telling you. Huh? <laughs> what did you say? He said pause. Pause. Yeah. You know when said that? Like, I don't know what the fuck go, he's yeah, talking he's about. Don't worry, but he's Yeah, go on, go on, go on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. <laughs> yeah, but when I hear when I heard um one of your tracks, yeah. I was that's what I was like, nah. Yeah. I'll go yeah, get you yeah. on, look you on, to do come and talk and break everything down. I know mm. look, yeah, come on, come on, yeah. come on. So then coming up, how you came up, um what have what 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 did that do? How kind of what kind of things you get into like 13, 14, what was guy you used to get suspended from school? What was what was what was what was going on? Like I had that transcend into where you came to because for me you're a knowledgeable person you're yeah. aware of yourself yeah do you get what i'm saying irrespective of what you may have come from now nah, mm. it's like um, as we talk as that's what we were, all we can ever desire as a human being to be able yeah. to grow learn from our lessons understand ourselves well and be a, a, a decent person in in society or whatever we're doing do you get what i'm saying and you empathize that or you embody that mm. sorry Thank for you. me so like from the child who was displaced and had his family displaced and was there, how did the transition? Like, yeah. what kind of trouble did you get into? Because I know if you want to talk about that, you could just talk about it from wherever you want to talk about. It. But go no, ahead. Whatever, like, so, so, like, um, I would say, like, do you know how crazy it is, right? Like, I remember when um, I like uh, I bought these hats, that right? Yeah, I should brand yeah, prolific. Yeah, prolific. And like two youths, like a year after came out, they they, they asked me like, oh, like. Like, how do I do hats and like mm. uh, I'm not trying to go subject, but I'm trying, trying to give you like an analogy what I'm talking about, yeah. Mm. And they're like, how, like, like, how did you like, how do you do hats and how can I do it? Now? And to me, like, I just got a reflection on myself and I thought, this is mad. Like these kids here want to learn how to make that. That touched me differently. Like these kids here want to learn how to make hats. Listen, when I was coming up, when I was when I was in year six, bro, I wanted to go hybrid grow because I thought Rupert went to that school. What kind mm. of fucking upbringing is that, bro? My mum gave me a good upbringing. Don't mm. run the household's good. But what was I thinking in my head? Mm. Like, like, when I think that, I think that's mad, like. It's culture. But I'm just saying, though, like, that, yeah. that's, you know what I'm saying? Stuff, they made us respect a lot of bullshit. Like, this is, like, mad, like. No, but, not for education. Yeah. Like, not for anything else, just because, yeah. like, there's... Yeah. You know what, though? Yeah. And I'm, at the same time, I'm into it. I'm, I'm, you know what I'm saying? You're thinking you look, you look all bop and all that, and... But it's like, why are you thinking like this at like this young age? Bro. Because you're copying and you're seeing these things, the environment. Mm. You know what I mean? It's the environment. So you try to embody these these characters that you see. And, but it's all for Partly crazy. survival. Because the depending on the time you come up in, in an uh, environment that you come up in, like when we look at, if we look at, uh, let's just say, like hoods all over the world, there's a sense of survival, as well as a sense of the, the glamorizing of it that gets done. That, that is also, I think, towards survival. Because, yeah. you know, like, if you had to accept everything that you had to deal with when you're younger, uh, when, we're, when we're younger, if you're going through impoverished, like, neighbourhoods and stuff, yeah, mm. that you either go crazy or you find a way to deal with it, mm. it and survive. And then I think some of the I wouldn't even stages of survival... I would say it's that, for example, right, yeah? A lot of us, a lot of us grew up in, like, um, estates, right? And... There was a lot of us that probably went to the same secondary schools, like whatnot, went to the same, like McDonald's, whatnot. But you see, when it came to coming out and doing certain things, certain man stayed at home. We all were trying to survive. <laughs> but you like this, though. You wanted to be outside. No, wait, no, 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 no. no wait, wait. I'm gonna, I've got something, but you can go and let me know. Yes, but you too. wanted to be there. Yeah. There was a difference between where, like, because there's some man, when it's like, it gets dark and all that, and, mm. like, man thinking of certain activities, are oh, you, man, you know what, I'm going home, you know? 
t- certain man stayed outside. Do you know what? You know no, what I mean, so like, prob- it's survival, but it's also like you wanting to be there, and it's like, what makes you? you know what I'm saying it's how you mold yourself. Well, propane. What, so what kind of mold you as well? If that makes sense. Listen, characteristics that you that you're born with. Yeah, it's maybe some 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 of us didn't didn't um decide to stay outside. Yeah. There's loads of different reasons why you was outside. Maybe not you, me, definitely. I know other people, maybe. Because mm. you was looking for, or you needed that um, father figure or an example of how to be a man. And the only examples of how to be men that hold their own were those examples. Whether um, they turned out to be negative or whatever, mm. those were the only examples that were men that stand up and doing their thing kind of mm. thing in whatever capacity. Mm. So, and then also sometimes you was outside because... There was problems at home. You was getting shouted at, getting beat, getting all sorts of things. I know there's all sorts of stories. Mm. You're coming into puberty. Well, I don't know if your, your story is your story, but mm. I was coming into puberty certain times yeah. and there's all them things going on and if someone doesn't understand you, what do you do? You buck out. You buck out and like you said, the examples you follow are the ones you can see in front of you. Yeah. At the time, the ones we could see in front of us and sometimes even now, the ones we see in front of us that are making the quickest cash are the people that are doing the worst things. Mm. Like I'm making it sound glamorous or whatever. And we know now that certain things we shouldn't have been doing, but we was outside doing those things. Mm. And like we said earlier, some things for some people are necessary. You have to go through the fire to break through to the next next part. It's part of your jigsaw Facts. puzzle, isn't it? Do you get what I'm saying? So it's, it's, it's mad, yeah. you know? Because the person sitting across from me now couldn't be the person if you never went through the things you went through. No, fact. Like, you know what I'm saying? And we're going to get into that. Mm. Do you get me? Fact. But going through it at the time, not nice. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That it's, it's, it's mad. It's mad. But I just feel like in that sense of the, um, what we was when we was younger, like how I saw it, I was outside and I was outside and then you look into who's got the loudest voice, who's got the most money. Like if you're outside long enough, it's just whoever's always outside still and then whoever's and doing the best is. thing. Yeah. If they're saying, come let's go and drum this yard, you're yeah. following them to drum a yard. Yeah. If they're going and their, their parents have got money, you're good. It's just, it was a roll of the dice as well on certain things. You know, one's there. But the same people that have parents have got money, they might be taking you someone to go and take drugs. Mm. Do you know what I mean? And then take yeah, you down that everyone road. Everyone had its own, it's yeah. Bro, it's all yeah. St- coming up, it's mad, bro. Mm. It's mad. And depending on the choices you make and how them choices affect you as well. That's and that comes true. down to your genes, what you were saying before, who you are as a person, mm. whether you can get through certain things or whether you've got that mental fortitude or, do you know what I mean? That yeah. willpower to say, mm. all right, I've fucked up, but I'm coming back and I'm doing this now. Mm. It goes back to that thing where, um, where I was telling you, I heard the other day where someone said, Everybody's got the same. That like, people can have the same parents, but not have the same parents. Yeah. Mm. So you like, and that goes down to people can have people can, like you could have a child with the same person, but it not be the same child as well. Yeah. Because every child responds differently to their parents. Mm. And the parents respond differently to the child because mm. everybody's individual. So yeah. you can't act, be the same with every child. <clears throat> so each parent gets to have to, has to parent their children differently. So you know what I mean. So mm. you can't, it's not just judged on the house. I don't think. Yeah, but <clears throat> when you're in propane mm. and like I was, I was my situation at certain times as well. When you're it's, you're displaced at a certain time, at a certain age within the household, whatever that reason is, whether your dad was there and he left, mm. or another man comes in, or even another child comes in, a ch- child can come in and a man could leave, but that still displaces certain people. Mm. It's caused friction where you know what I'm saying. When it comes to that, it's like then it's down to the things I was saying before. Yeah, no, I get what you mean, but I just feel like you know, like every child is different. So you know, like yeah. you, and your, you and your brother might have had the same experiences or sister, similar experiences, because you came up in the same house, but turned out totally different. Oh, absolutely. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then your reasons for being that way is that, and your his reasons for being that way is that. So. Yeah, yeah. Why you're saying was right here yeah. because what I think I was watching, I forgot whose podcast it was. I think it might be Big Frank's one. Yeah. And um, it was like because my mum, not my mum, but it's like a known thing, like in that. Like in the African uh, um, culture, like, um, you see the first son yeah. as a sacrificial lamb, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. He goes through like the madnesses, yeah, so them lot can yeah. be better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, you're right. Yeah. Like everyone, every kid's gonna be like have dip, like the the, the, the the like for example, like um, I feel like when I first came in, my mum was much harsher on me, mm. and as time went by, the, the harshness went a bit more or less. So my so young sister mm. never really got it as much. You know what I'm saying mm. because maybe living in this country. And how things are dealt with, do you know what I'm saying? It's, it's that, it's yeah. like it's a snail on the head. Yeah. Because so. you come in with, that's the same thing we you said before. Mm-hmm. You come in with wherever you're coming from, yeah. with that ethos, that way of living, that understanding how I had to deal with situations. Then, you, then you're now in a situation that is mm-hmm. a million miles away from there. Like my mum <clears> expects <throat> me to have a better understanding than my sisters. Because 
I've literally come from her. Come, yeah, come, come yeah. with her from that same place. They ain't, they don't know about all of that. Yeah. They just know about waking up in Europe and they get Nikes in these joints. And <laughs> listen, we managed to wear high tech in these. Listen, yeah, hey, yeah, 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 they've yeah. never experienced that. <laughs> You're so, lucky on high tech. I've done lot, mate. Sacrificial lamb. Like, I had to, do you know what I'm saying? Like, I had to, do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I had to go through that. So you look and be, yeah, you know I'm saying? You look and be good. You get know what I'm saying? But yes. Yeah, they're around and on there, I agree. Mm. Well, it's nice. What's your relationship with like with your with your siblings? Ah, proper. Nice. Proper man. Nice. Tell me Each about it. Each other, form some time, come some food, vice versa, like that. Yeah. That's that's yeah, man. It's nice. Brother. How many siblings you got? Um, I got two on my on mom's so three of us on my mum's side. And my dad's a hell, mate. Mm. It's a bad. <laughs> yeah, it's a lot. Yeah, about, I'm losing you on the mic. Huh? About six, seven. Six, seven, okay. Yeah, about that, yeah. Nice. Yeah. Nice, yeah. nice, 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 nice. Yeah. Huh. So, going through what you went through, what did you go through? What do you mean? Like, um, you're eight, nine. I had a question when you were... Okay, go on. Yeah. Was, uh, um, how did the uh, music help you deal with what you was going through when you was growing up? Um, and how did you get into music? I've always always loved music, you know. I, huh? I thought you said we were not going to talk about music. Then you got to talk about music. You no, said no music, talking about music? Start with music he said. You said don't start with music? Yeah. Oh. Um, oh okay. I'm just with I'm missing music. Yeah, I know, I'm I've, missing music. I've always liked, I've always um, just loved music. Like, so, even, like I said, I used to go to church. Like, I had to sing in the church. Like, nice. They'll put me in front of, I will like, oh, put pictures up on my grandma. Like, yeah. Put me up in the church yeah. and I'm singing with them and whatnot. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Give, it, give it some, yeah? yeah nice, was, nice, nice. And then, um, like, I was always loved their music, bro. So like, even in artists when you were younger, like who's your inspiration? Michael Jackson was my guy. Whoever went, we went to my primary school knows about me. I was doing the mean walks and sounds like this guy. You still, you can still move what, yeah? Not no more, but yeah, I was doing <laughs> the mean walks. I knew all the tunes there. I was, you know, what I'm saying that was that was my guy, Mike. You know mm -hmm. I mean? so, yeah, that's how. And yeah, and then um, and then I, when did properly started taking not properly but I started doing music when I started um like doing music not like doing some like primary school shit doing music I think it was and I always say it like Heartless Crew so um, okay big up Heartless Crew so um no my brethren growing up called my brethren Tolson growing up right that was like my guy and um who? Tolson you know Tolson. Tolson yeah Tolson that was my guy growing up right so like differently so like <laughs> So you are gonna ask me if you know if I love yeah. Tolson. You know how how we family. Of course, of course I know. Yeah, I know all that. Bro. So um, I'm with him now, and he's playing me um, Mission FM, telling me these are my people. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm gassing. Who are these guys? Oh, let's screw like, I'm thinking they're gassing because I've never heard nothing like this. I think I'm just playing like rap music. Yeah, like just like like Biggie's the. Two packs. I don't even know what the man I even talk because I'm still young. I'm like eleven, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But yeah, probably about about eleven, twelve, them sort of time. Mm. And then um, one day my brother Nathan called me. I'm like, raw, Heartless Crew doing a workshop, and I think it's might be like six months later. Heartless Crew doing a workshop, and I'm gonna come down. Obviously, yeah. Gosh, <laughs> Obviously, I on. couldn't do music because I never knew nothing about music. I knew about music, but in terms of like um like like um writing and yeah, yeah. I never had no clue or nothing yeah, yeah. yeah and I just screwed in man they showed me a little pattern and from then nice. I just went on nice that's how it nice. started you know, nice, nice, nice. and then so then what what kind of how did you um emerge with it for yourself as an artist like what was your genre how did you what was like what was your thing my first thing like at first I started doing um I started doing garage because obviously heartless screw like I'm doing garage what not but it wasn't sitting with me though. Mm. It wasn't like, no, it wasn't. Like I said, I was troubles at home or whatnot. And, mm. and the rather I'm chatting about it, it's just, I'm chatting shit, bro. Like mm. it's just violent and just like lie, bro, man. Like it's just, just like, it's just reckless, like reckless. Mm. Like lie, bro. And then. Would you say, would you say comparing it to some of the current drill music? And then, um, like, and then I would ask you after that, like it's where certain people are at certain ages. Do you know what I mean? Would you, could you, you could you compare it in any way, shape, or form? No, no. All right. I wouldn't. Yeah or no? Nah, I wouldn't. I wouldn't. With the anger, just because to me, like I'm just hearing because you're saying you're angry at the time, yeah. you're getting stuff out on it. But the, so, the bar was like, you get bored in the nose, like shut stupid. up, bro. <laughs> <laughs> but it can be compared to Drew. I know, but it's like 
Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So I remember I had the, I think the staff people at our album, Gangsta and the Gentleman, and I think it was the tune Gangsta and the Gentleman. Mm. And when I heard it, I thought, this is my life, bruv. Talking about his mum came from Africa. And I said, yo, I want to rap. Yeah. From then, and yeah, I started slowly doing a bit of rap. And then I just left the garage off, man. Mm. Yeah. yeah, with Garage as well. I used to like, do stuff with like, Bigger Fish and stuff. Yeah, Ice Kid. Ice Kid, that's what his name was. Ice, Ice Kid. Yeah. yeah. Oh, would, yeah, the first one. Yeah. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Ice Kid. Yeah, yeah, You're going to talk to the mic because I keep losing you. The Ice Kid, Ice Kid. Yeah, the Ice Kid, yeah, respectfully. Because where it was, like, my name, like, from, I used to live in, like, um, New York Green back in the day. And they used to all call me Kid. I'll be, I'll be outside with the older one. They used to call me Kid. Kid, Kid, you know what I'm saying? So when I moved, when I moved to Finbury Park, right? Uh, my met my brethren, he didn't school, they call him Kitty. And I'm a guy, I'm like, I don't have the same name as me, you know what I'm saying? So at first I call myself Wizkid. Mm. My name Merlin. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Wizkid. Mm. That That's name. your government, Merlin. Yeah. Well, Whiskid's not mm. strong name. Yeah, I don't really I don't really like this Whiskid, mate. It's a bit, mm. sounds a bit at the time it sounds yeah. a bit a bit techy and like, mm. like computerish whiskey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm saying I'm cold though. Ice kid. <laughs> you know, like at the time, like, oh, ice kid, yeah, ice kid. But you tried to quickly go past that. This my man used to win competitions and all yeah, that. Yeah, my first, yeah, I think, yeah, yeah, I done a competition. That's but a that was, man, that was, but that was yeah, for, I think under 21, Heartless yeah, could bump me for that, you know. Oh, nah. I'm saying, they're my people's. Bumped you, They're my people's, yeah. They're my people's, but art, yeah. What happened? But they showed me love already. They showed you love later, yeah? Yeah, all the time, everywhere else. It's always, always, always. They had a prize. Oh, they finessed me, my boy. What? Yeah, what happened? My boy, but they finessed me, so they brought me to one thing. Now that 13, sound of that 13. Gone to one thing, I think might have been Rumpa Stomper under 21s. I'm a young dude. I shouldn't be even in there. Do you know what I'm saying? I think we had a set in there, and then after that, we had a. Yeah, the my competition, right? And I've won it. But you won in, what is it? Yeah, you're meant to win two bills. Me. Yeah, you're meant to win two bills. Yeah, but what's the competition? Like, who do you want up against someone else? Or you might just go, how many yeah. people? People from that area, this area? It was just, I don't know, the f- f- fingers might people? be like four on each side or whatnot, and then whoever wins, you know what I'm saying? That okay. Basically, that person beats that person and gets closer. And, yeah, you know yeah, what I'm yeah, yeah. I said, uh, eight people, yeah. you won it. Yeah, I won it. You know what I'm saying? Young boy. Yo, boom. I, I forgot who came. I might have been Bushkin or Fontney that came on the mat. I said, Oh, yeah, we said it was two hundred pounds. We kind of got it mistaken, and that was twenty pound, and that. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> and these times they're right, yeah. <laughs> and these times they're right, yeah. Go on, point like, to I was mad because I'm thinking twenty pounds. Like these times they're you trying to do a little thing, so like twenty pounds is not that much. Like don't try and bump me. Like you know, like you might be like gas to the twenty pound, thinking bump me, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah he's pissed. Oh, mad. Like, I remember coming back on the on the coach with the and the rest of the the, the, the people that came with us, and man, I asked me. Buy me some food though. I'm looking at that. Man, <laughs> I just got 20 pounds, bro. 20 quid, you know. Don't worry about it. Fuck it, fuck it. Yeah, come on. Man. Come on. But yeah, they're people though. Like, over there. No, yeah, everywhere I see them, it's like, it's. Yeah. I ain't yeah. got paying no The family too, man. The family, the family. Yeah. Yeah. Like, I was like, like. Yeah, he was like a young bush kid back when he was like 12. Yeah, I told you, I told him yeah. the heart, heart was written when I had to go to the. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. So I must have seen you around if you told him. I must have seen you around a lot. Yeah, definitely. But I'll come to the house, to Nan's house over there. And okay. That, that, you know what okay. I mean? Okay. Like, so, yeah, yeah so then when, you went into the, when you went in from the embassy and into rap, how, how was the transition from there? Um, I was doing it slowly. Like, we'll do tunes here and then. I wasn't really, like, I was because I was more that, I was doing stuff with like Bigger Fish. So every month I'm getting booked. What's Bigger Fish? I'm done Bigger Fish was like a, like a youth organisation. And they do like raves like every month, like at mm-hmm. Forum, Rocket Complex. Okay. They used to have Bear Man there, like I used to have a successful Wally and all that. And big Up Knee. Yeah, yeah, Big Up Knee, the cult, the, the fan of it, like that, like that was proper still, like they bust me. I wonder if a lot of them was showing me lots Big Up Knee. Knee, Knee. Knee, Big Up Knee. Yeah, Knee Saki is the guy that, that, that found the, um, the program. And um, they were just booking me out, so I was doing a lot of shows, a lot of shows. And um, I think I might have turned like 16, right? And um, they wanted to like do like a group. And this is when I think I've took rap a bit seriously. Like, um, they wanted to do like a group, Bigger Fish group. But I was trying to bring in my, um, my, my guys, who's called YBM, like, at the time. I was trying to bring them through, like, um, but YBM? Knew, yeah. Why that, YBM? What? YBM for what? What was it called? What was the name? What was it? Oh, Young Blood Militia. Okay. okay. Yeah. So, um, I'm trying to bring them into, like, so because, because it was a, it was a, it was a good system in terms of where, like, um, they get you to raise. So you're, you're building up your name. So in Northwest in certain places, my name was, you know what I'm saying? Like right, young, yeah. yeah. So it was a good system. So I wanted to bring my guys into that, but 
knee and all that. They had they, they, they had their plans for who they had their plans for. I weren't really feeling it, like, because, like, as much as I'm doing this youth, we're gonna, we're gonna, like, I'm doing it because it's more time I'm getting booked by myself <clears throat> or I'm getting booked with Kitty mm. or they're putting us in some group with, like, other individuals that I might just know through, like, this organisation, which is cool. No disrespect to that, but these are my guys. Like, mm. we, we, we also do, like, radio... That's what I'm saying. We was young, like, year 10, I think, year 11. Yeah, yeah, year 10 or year 11. Mm. We're going, like, that? radio. I'm like, yeah, I'm, like, 40, 15, 16. I'm okay. yeah. So we're going, like, radio stations and certain things. So we're building up our own name anyway as YBM. Mm. So, I just, so I just wasn't, like, really with it, um, doing the whole bigger fishing. So I kind of, like, slid more with the, the, um, with the YBM thing. And I was still, I'm big at big because they were still booking me respectfully. Like they were still booking me, even though it's like, good. Yeah, I like I respect for that. So um, we started doing that, and then I was doing rap tracks, but then my name was still called Ice Kid. Like I'm, you know what I'm saying I'm like, yeah. And then I remember we've um, done a tune with Sincere one time. That's the day I actually changed my name. I think of the of, of the name Propane from before, like, but I never knew when to like. Bring it in, do you know what I mean? It's working with the elements. Yeah, I never knew when to bring it in, so we're doing this tune now. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> From the <laughs> of the yeah. You're on the beat, the bass was in your voice, you said, yeah, go on. Yeah, so back to the so, so when I'm, so we thought we're doing this tune, me and Napalm and Sincere. Napalm, one of my guys. And, um, Big up and, Sincere as yeah. well, man. Yeah, because that, that was the day I, I changed my name, so I'm, I said to, I said to both of them, like, what do you think, like, I asked to propane, man. Propane. <laughs> <laughs> I never look back. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah he's great. And from then, I was just doing more like rap. So even with YBM, we were still doing garage here and then, but we kind of like took more like the rap lane. You know what I mean? Mm. That's what kind of like I just I, know, I ain't never look back. To be fair, mm. I just kind of start with that genre, mm. rapping thing. So, uh, what's so in, inspiration wise? Like what's rap? Huh? Um. So first, my first inspiration from rap was probably I'll say Styles P. That was my guy. And then I'll just keep it real. Like, when I first started rapping, like, and because I'm a guy that's got, f I, I, I embody a flow, like a cold flow. But at first, I used to, um, I used to have a freeway flow. If you know freeway from state property, yeah. like, he used to, um, they used to do, like, stuff on, like, who the fuck are you guys? Like, sick. And I didn't even know at the time I'm doing it. I'm like, bro, I sound a bit like a freeway, you know, let me mm. kind of turn up to my own thing. But, uh, like, that was my, my freeway, um, locks, dips there, Jay-Z. Yeah, hey, those are, like, my inspirations on, like, music and stuff. Mm. Yeah, all that type of shit. Mm. Mm. So, life. Mm. Where have you been in the world? Where have I been? Yeah. Um, ooh. Do you travel, man? Yeah, I just came back from Rome recently. I was in Rome recently. Rome, yeah? Yeah, Rome. Because you're just in Rome. Like, like it's nothing. <laughs> what do you mean? Rome. You know, I'd love to go. I haven't been to Rome yet. Okay, I'd okay, love to okay. go to Rome. I've been to Rome. Been what, there, you, what are you doing in Rome? I was there with my missus. Okay. Yeah, What's it like? Birthday. Proper stuff, I won't lie. Like, as much, like, you know that you get this perception like, like people are racist over there or whatnot. Oh. But um, I didn't feel no vibe or anything like that. It was good, you know what I'm saying? Statues and the city looks proper, so yeah, we got Rome, Stair Rome, Tenerife, um, France, people's over there, obviously, France, Germany, uh, Portugal, Malia, Lanzarote. Nice. I've basically just been in Europe, bro. I ain't done yeah. like the mad ones, like, I need to go like, 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 like the, the Americas and the Dubai. I ain't done them ones there yet, so mm. I'm saying that's still pending. Mm. They head over to them joints there. Mm. What do you think of the um, the current state? When I say state, the, just the current state of like everything, like music on the internet, artists, how you gain notoriety, just all of that. Saturated. Do you think there's, there's any opportunities to, to, to grow? Yeah. In one the, word, the, not the, in one word, you just gave me saturated, but I want you to elaborate a bit more for me. For you, like for example, just be different. Like for example, there's, like I've always said like, See, some of the main artists, right? Like the main, like, for example, the Drakes or the Jay Z's or the Beyonce's or whatnot, yeah? They don't follow sound. They create sound. So, like, there's nothing wrong with doing what's popping right now, but don't follow the sound. Mm. Be a sound and create your own sound. And I feel like that's where the game's going to be a thing because <clears throat> everyone they hear something that's popular, now everyone wants to do it 
cool, do it once, but don't try and do it like 10 times more than the person that actually done it once. Mm. Just like, I just feel like it's saturated with a certain sound and, and yeah, I don't know. But um, as far as like to me, like, like I'm from I'm from the area where like um just YouTube and certain things, you know. So so to see the game where is as much as I will say what well, what that that's that's me in terms of like music and being a fan. But <clears throat> me personally, like like I love where the game is at right now. I won't even stunt you because um as much as I might not got to eat the fruit. I right keep now, missing you on the mic. Sorry, as much as I'm not might not get to eat the fruits right now. What's that's what I'm saying? Um. The young boys are doing it, and they're they're they they the game's proper. You see me. I always say to people, you see the fruits. That, and I, if if people always equate the fruits to being like um, rich, yeah, successfully rich, I feel like so much of your life experience get missed out. Yeah, and a lot of the things that we've experienced is money come by. Mm. Like being who we who who you who you were in the game, the the, the spaces that God's put the things that God's put us here to do. Mm. Sometimes we we would have had a, done some amazing things, but if it didn't equate to us being rich at the end of it, we don't feel like we made like we were successful in it. And mm. I think that's a bit. And but that's where bitterness comes in because I'm I'm never that in terms of no, where I'm like talking about you. No, no, I'm saying but uh, that's where bitterness comes. Look and you think rather. Than, I'm like happy because you know what man paved the way for these guys. But I feel like you ate, you ate the fruits that you needed to because you're not you're not down. My thing is, that, and, and, and as a as a person, a pioneer of the game, you're mm. definitely one of the biggest guys that 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 set where to where it is now. Yeah. Like, a lot of the early video guys and that, yeah, you was one of the first people to work with them. You was one of the first people from north to south to even be respected. A lot of people on, on, on the other side of the waters, yeah. And why I say I and don't, you, and you shared it with everyone. And why I say I'm not bitter on these things because. I literally don't care. If it, if, I, if I was in a better situation, what in terms of like music, what or not, God bless, salute that. That's what I was meant to be. But in terms of like where I don't care, in terms of where like, this is actually me, like where everyone's doing well and everyone's doing things, salute to that, man. Do you know what I'm saying? The, the game's <clears throat> in a place, like you said, like when I've got something, I'm giving it to everybody else and the game, sometimes it might not be shared back to you, mm. but this is who you are though. That's Forget right. what everyone else is on. That's you know right. what I'm saying? That's and right. to see where, like I said, saying, right. see where the game is right now. See where the game is right now. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, that's it. See where the game is right now. It's nuts, like the collaborations, the shows. The, um, do you know? Um, yeah, yeah, man. The game, the game's in the top place, though. Huh? The, the, top game's, place. the game's in the top place. The music's better. Um. um mm. So, ooh, that's a, that's that's a tough one still. Can I? Because I say 50 50. Can I ask you something? 50 50. Can I yeah. Something? So I had a couple of questions. Yeah. Um. Like. Ooh. Okay, first one. Mm. I don't want to be. I don't want to put them the right way around. All right, cool. You've got a back catalogue, right? Yeah, big one. Cool. All right, let me just put it, let me put it like that. What are you, what, were, what, what are you, what are you in the game for? What is the game to you? Because this is the thing where I think that not you, mm. but people get it twisted. Like, do you get what I'm saying? Because mm. you've created art, mm. your art. Like you said, you've done your thing in it. Mm. It's there for the masses. Mm. That might equate to dough when you're gone, but it's done right now. You've you've got a catalog. Do you get what mm. I'm saying? Of your art, I can go and listen to your stuff. Mm. That's you poured onto a track into a thing, Project, but that's why I do what I do. Do you yeah. get what I'm saying? Yeah. Getting the money from it is a bonus, mm. but if you're allowed to do that and no one can now contaminate your thing, mm. propane, it's like fire. I've just, I, don't, I don't even know what kind of noise I could do for propane, <laughs> but I've just fucking find one. You know, I got one for everyone else. Like I don't, even, yeah, I'll find one anyway. But I'm saying, do you get what I'm saying? And then. That's that was a question. Like, what do we get in, into it for? For to is it? And that's the, some of the artists now. What are they in it for? And that will talk to the kind of quality of the art that they're bringing out as well. Are they in it for the money, or they in it for the art form? Are they, are they expressing themselves, or are they? It was, sometimes it can be it can be combined. I would say that because like you're in it for the love and you're in it for the money. Let's not forget because if you're trying to say you're not in it for the money, you're just standing in the lack of... If you're just not saying it for the money and you're spending their money, bro, just don't release music. I would say, let's be honest, right? Don't release music. If you're just gonna do it, if you're not doing it for the money, because yeah. everyone's like, I don't do it for, for the love. I hear with that. But if you're not, because yeah. it's, it's, it's the game's like a free mic. You might, you might, you might not. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. So, but the main thing, mm. I would say, like for myself, why I did it for my last projects, self-explanatory, therapy. Like, a lot of times, right? A lot of times, 
I can get things off my chest, my boy. That's that's you know it. What that's what's up. I, I can do. I can get things off my chest. Yeah. So, like I realized with a lot of people, where like um, it was just the love. It was, it was just the money. Because if it's just the love, right, you're gonna keep doing it. But then it's like, oh, cool. But see, if it's just for the money, you're gonna quit soon. As it's looking a bit bleak, you're cutting. But see, when it's therapy, man, won't be like going through whatever you're going through with your missus or your whatever your life. You just wanna talk about it. Just, you know what I'm saying it's, it's a medium. It it's, a, it's a medium for you yeah. to express yourself. Yeah, and that's what it. That's what these things are. So yeah, and it's the like this. It's beautiful, yeah. Paul Payne. That's what I'm and that's what it's like. You know, like yeah. I've heard some of your stuff. I've yeah. heard more of it. Yeah. I'll go and look at the catalog and stuff. When people are doing it and it's coming from the soul, mm. it's a beautiful thing. You could sit across the board on all different kinds of genres and stuff. Mm. And some people are really good at it. Mm. Those are the people I suggest. Not that no one shouldn't do it, mm. but then they. They'll get the bag from what, from doing that because it's so beautiful. The more it comes from your soul, the more the more the more. Because it's you, like you yeah, can't, you can't. And that's what it, that's all it should be. And no then, one can't be a better version of you, bro. Ah, so and your legacy is important. Yeah. As well. like, I feel like people concentrate on having a bag, and the bag is the legacy. Like when you when you're gone from here, what if, what is there to to show that you was here? Yeah, that therapy. But the game's mad, sorry to what? cut you, but the game's mad as well because people love to change history. And like, I remember one time when my, when my boy was having a convo with like, like, and I actually get because I'm not on no sympathy type shit or none of that type shit, you know what I'm saying? Mm. Like, winners tell the story, bro. Winners tell the story? Yeah, bro. I don't believe that. Oh, mate. <clears throat> so the reason, why, the reason why I would agree with that, right, it's nothing to do with rap, to do with how the world, there's bad okay. messed up history, bro. That the winners told the story, that how they wanted it to go down. Winners don't tell stories. Winners just win. Like, sto no. beat, someone can get beaten up and they'll go and tell someone. No, that one no. Fight. What I basically it's mean, right, yeah? If I came over to you man's country and um, done our madness, whatnot, yeah? Like, you, the real people know what really happened. But I will tell you, nah, them not start trouble first and whatnot to make me look good. The winners tell the story, bro. What, that, tell stories, what bro. I basically mean, right, yeah? Well, I hear what you're saying. My brother like, called me the other day. I'm going to listen to the loser, basically. But my, no. my brother called me the other day, right? And he said, Raw, they really try to take man out of their game and not try and put I think there's a ch Channel U documentary. Mm. And um, like they're not mentioning certain. Raw, da, 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 da. They, I'm I, used to that shit. Uh, no, no, but I'm saying they this. They even is, use my videos. But I'm saying this is where stuff. winners tell the story because whoever's won is going to. Bro, what I'm trying to say is that, yeah, a winner, right? no, no, what I basically mean, whoever's in front will narrate and tell the story, bro. Mm. Whoever wants to tell the story can tell the story. No, remember, some people have got bigger platforms than others. The so yeah. the truth, bare man's things get stolen and yeah. see the guy's majority of them, mm -hmm. they'll make it seem like, God, oh, this guy's chatting rubbish. What would I talk from him for? Mm. Do you know what I'm saying? Because at the so moment he's winning. You said all history is true. Who? All history is true then. No, that's why I said winners tell the story. So, yeah, but even so if sometimes if it's a lie, yeah, mm. they're going to tell their story how they want it to sound. Mm. Because because they won. But that doesn't make them winner. Bro, no, but he's saying the, the history is made bro. by the person who wins. The, yeah, loser, the loser can't tell a story because they lost. Yeah, bro. It's like, it's, it is. Tell stories. Winning no, losers do tell stories, out. but most people don't believe their stories because they lost. That's, that's the way and it goes. Losers tell stories. No. Yeah, they do. No, no. But you know, what I basically mean, they narrate the story, bro. Like, for yeah. example, yeah. They dictate the um, way, yeah. Like, like, for example, you know, like back in the day when they chop off, um, shoot off their man's noses and all that, the Egyptian nose and all that, yeah? Like, the story is now, like, they maybe, like, people that know, know, but the story is, the Egyptians was a, a certain colour. Mm. When they wasn't, that's a story that they've made up because they've done certain things towards that. If the, if, if there was little boys, them man that did them type of things there, they can never pull that type of move off. But because there was the guy probably on a, on, on a hierarchy, mm. they can pull it off because they've got their agenda. Yeah. And that's what I basically mean. All I'm saying is that half of the stories that we know are not true, yeah? Yeah, half but they'll be told by winners who yeah, may, may or may not have lied, but yeah. they don't tell the story. Not necessarily. Because I'm saying winners, like someone that's telling a story, a story, you know? Yeah. yeah. Not the truth. A story. <laughs> Maybe see, see, but a what story, is it? What is it? A story, a story, it was a, a story, in it, yeah. Or a also a narrative uh, and their agenda. So what, <laughs> what their agenda <laughs> is and what they're trying to push out might not be what it really is, but they're making you it. Can't like, handle the truth. Who? No, um, no, that's a um, few good men. Sorry. Yeah. yeah. No, but that's not. I'm thing. fucking around again. Yeah. Even when it comes to a lot of the 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 history that people have been told, a lot of it's bullshit. A lot of it's their story, <laughs> not not our story. That's what I mean. That, for example, right? Yeah. But you couldn't tell. You couldn't tell. You see that when it comes to real things, if you know anyone that that is really, really real and is not really talkers, yeah. Yeah. 
a lot of the stories of a lot of situations that everybody talks about, mm. no one really hears the real stories from the horse's mouth. So, like, again, like I say to you, it, the, it, in, ter- in terms of, like, honour and things like that, like, honour and and all of them things there, yeah? Same mm. way, like, if, if, if I'm ever sitting down and pro- uh, I'm with a certain artists and they try to go around not mentioning you or something, yeah? yeah. And I'll mention it. My thing is, the winner is, is the honour. You know what I'm saying? The, the, the winner is the honour in, Jay, in, in I get your part, bro. You're speaking about you honour and certain... But I, I get what you're saying. Honour among yeah? thieves. I get, but for example, like, um, like a man can right now know about Jay, mm-hmm. have links to Jay-Z and Drake and the man that said, yo, I started UK over storage, you know? But because... See, the man them in Irons, in like, Irons or so, in Nation. Let's, 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 let's not dumb it down because our things... You know what I'm saying? The Nation right here. Yeah? Yeah. Well, no, this guy's chatting bare shit. But he's probably paid publicists to make it so no, this is our uh, thing. We really started it. We knew Overstudy came around and helped us a little bit. And because that's, he's got a bigger platform, might have bigger money, and he's gonna. That doesn't make, that doesn't make him a winner. It makes him a loser. Yeah, but you're. But he's but, won, technically he's won. Like, you're being pedantic now, but he, that he has won. He's, saying, he's cooking. Win if they're telling a lie, though. But if the if he ends up with the with whatever the rights are, his Bro, lies see, believe, see, then they've won that the argument. Yeah, we don't. You don't know what people do. Yeah, in in in, in all like, but you don't know what people do gone. to yeah. get their positions as well. So but like, for how me, much people do you f- tracks have been teeth, and you know the person's teeth they trap, but they got more dough than them, so they've got their trap now. Yeah, bro. I'm saying, if someone says to you, yeah, all right, cool, someone's gonna make you do something against your anything and against yourself, yeah, yeah, and you got to go in that room and and have and go and have sex with what. Ten man in there, and mm. when you come out, you're gonna any 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 competition is gonna be eliminated. Is he a winner? No. What? I don't even know. I man don't understand what I'm saying. No, I'm no, saying, no, 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 saying? no. Someone I, should go in the room. Everything you're saying, yeah. And who I'm saying? Like, no, Jay, Jay, Jay. Like in, a, in in the media world, let's just put it straight. See, like media world, yeah. There's a lot of different things going on. Yeah. People get perks for different things, innit? Yeah. yeah. So if depending on like, do, do you want to walk away with your dignity? Or but you're talking about you, something else. He's no, saying no, that how winners no, dictate no, things no, happen. No. You're saying someone going and selling, having sex with people, yeah. getting a hundred million or something, and being and calling that winning. That's not winning. But they, they will be the person that can tell any story they want because they got a hundred million now. No, I, no, I, I, was, I, was, I was basically talking. The, 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 you get what I'm saying. How I'm basically talking. I'm basically talking about like, dick, like for example, like to, just, just to break it down, right? Here, just simply to break. I came from what you call it the other day, Rome the other day, right? Yeah, and I clocked something. Like, I said, right, like. You see the way the um, the rivers and everything's built. It's kind of it's all the same, right? From France, up in France, um, France, Rome. Who else is it again? I think London. They're all kind of the same, but it's a blueprint. Yeah, someone set that up. Yeah, even the roads, right? Yeah, but who set up those roads? They say the Romans. Yeah, the Romans had. <laughs> no, no, let's get, I'm never gonna get on some. You know what I'm saying, but I'm, I'm saying, you know what I'm saying. <laughs> oh, yeah, sorry. So cool. I'm not saying they never started it, but we all know where they went and got certain knowledges. So they can run off and say, yeah, we started this. Does that make sense? Mm. Because there was, at the time, they was ruling the world. So when you're ruling the world, you implement and you put your stamp on it. That's the, I, I'm, like, this happens with a lot of things. Let me ask you this question and, and I'm finished with this, this subject about who's, who's the winner. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you'll be the winner. You, you see, when you, you finish, you'll be the winner. consider 6 9 as a winner in the situation with Treyway? What's that? 6 9 is it, what do you mean as a winner? Like, you know, like, okay, like, I don't know. Do you consider Ghana a winner? In the situation with um, do you know like, no no what's the, no what's the, you know why they yeah. both lost everyone's lost everyone's lost no but if he gets to tell the story who he's out he's, I'm saying someone's someone's gonna be out so you think no. you think six nine is the winner you know what I'm talking about yeah I know but everyone's no. lost but I'm saying do you think six nine is the winner though he's no he's lost story. no he's lost but he's telling the story and that man can't tell no no, no 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 see the, the reason why six nine can't do that right now because we actually we've witnessed everything maybe in a hundred years time. Someone can break it down like he was the winner no, and try to, but now like we're said, in the hood. We would like we're only no. The hood ev- people everyone's lost to, to us. To me, to no, me, he's win. He's got, he's got fans that don't give to a fuck me, about that. Everyone's thing. lost because you know why. Do you know what I'm saying? To, to me, everyone's lost. To why? Why everyone's lost? Because you've done the mad thing and and rather than your boys, you've lost already. Like your honor and certain things gone. But that's what I'm talking about, though. But I'm just saying. I'm just basically saying. How did Six now win? He he, he sold out his friends, bro. You don't, that, who, what are you trying to even know who they are? It's gone, it's gone completely. But, but what I'm basically trying to ba- like basically, he's the one that's telling the story. What I'm, what, so we have to we have to vet the person that's telling the story before we call them a winner. That's what I'm, I'm saying. Because sometimes people win on all kinds of conditions. Yeah. I'm a, I'm in all different industries, isn't it? Yeah. At this point in my life, yeah. And I I know where I've started, I've all different places and I've seen what people do. 
And a lot of time with the orig- originators get slept on on a lot of things. So yeah. they'll be into fashion. There's people that there are people that are in good places that go and see underground fashion people and then just take their you know what I'm saying take yeah, their fat, things. Fat, there's, fat, there's, fat. There's, there's rappers that are not as popular. Yeah, yeah. And then the big pop, popular guys listen yeah, to the tune and just take the whole yeah. thing. Yeah. Yeah. And then no one can say anything. Yeah. Yeah. You know, I'll be trying to the court and might get paid yeah. off or be like you're chatting. Yeah, there's all of this stuff. Or might they have the peace to go to court for them? Yeah, might even have the peace. Yeah. And so like all of these stuff that. That cre- that kind of spoils the creative side, yeah, and mm. spoils the the side of it when pe- for, from the people that just wanted to do it through the passion. Because mm. usually a lot of things are pioneered by, by people of passion. Mm. Do you guys say it? So that, that, that uh, love me, it. I always I always want people to know whether it's people. I feel like everyone knowing everything about you. This is why I don't really overly do interviews myself because mm. I don't think people, no one even cares anyway. Mm. Mm. So it's not even like you know like the people that's telling the stories because some of these people are telling the stories. I see man. Do a, a BET thing the other day with the Femi. Femi did it and um, Nicky Slim thing. Yeah. Femi went to my primary school. I know Femi differently. Yeah. Like I know Femi differently, as you know. Like mm. even as the DNOs man or mm. something, you'd know, bro. They might know what I've done in the game, mm. but they would still miss me out. Mm. You know what I'm saying? And I know how it goes. I know how people do these things. Mm. I don't. I won't. I'll never be giving people a call or a page like, yo, bro, are you? You know me and you're doing. I don't. No, I, I don't, don't need no that. because I'm saying half of the time yeah. is a reason why they're missing you out. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like, not everyone's as freelance as you think. Mm. And sometimes I've, I've even heard from people who, like that's that's been brave enough to tell me, oh, that man said, yeah, yeah, like, yeah, you can't really work with you. And, oh, this one's a bit, yeah, it's a bit of competition. And, oh, yeah, because you don't fuck with this one. And mm. there's a lot of that going on as well. Do you know what I'm saying? So I'm just saying within the music game, yeah. There's that too. The, no one's won like that in England for anyone to tell a story. Like, you know, like, <laughs> who's that big in America yet? In the UK? Yeah. He's bringing it oh, 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 right now. It's um, Central Sea, and, th- and th- is, that, is, that, is that the biggest we can say then? So imagine that Who? Central Sea is the biggest thing we've got. And that, but I'll say got in, in, ter- in terms of like sales, I'll say Central Sea. But in terms of like coach, I'll say gigs. Is it because yeah, he, 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 he looks like he looks like he's with them? No, but bit more he went there and made his own connections. Yeah, yeah. When it was when it was about the UK giving him the certain ratings. We ain't seen it. gigs when he made his own connections. Yeah, that's what I mean. He looks like he's with them. It's not some. How long? Yeah. It's not this not no overnight thing. I don't see them, they don't like Central Sea like that. When I film my people in America, they're not like, oh Central C. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, no, but I like Central C, man, because no, I see I a lot of like, you know I like the Central C. Some, <laughs> some, some guy go. from like some guy from like um I think it's from like Bush. You leave alone, you know? It's from Bush, from Bush. It's from Bush. Yeah, yeah, it's from somewhere, man. Yeah, okay, yeah, so yeah. What, he's an artist. Yeah, he's an yeah. artist still. Okay, what kind of artist? Um I think drill. he does drill, like and okay. They make some girl and all that. To me personally, I'll be honest with you, right? I don't even like I probably know about three or four of his tunes right here. I'm not a, a big fan of him like that. Mm. But I just rate what he's doing, bro. What is he doing? Why are we talking about him then? What is he doing? Um, I think he mentioned about who's the biggest artist from the UK that's in America. Like, we're not, oh, oh, oh. No one's doing that great in America. So I'm saying before we start giving ourselves hella credit about like, you know, like, um, not even just America, just, you know, like, on, on, on the same way an American artist can hit impact, like, yeah, impact, like, the world. Yeah. Like, with the ones that we've had that done are singers like Amy Winehouse, um, Adele, you understand what I'm saying to you? Like, there's people... Yeah, but we're years behind America, so we got we got to respect that as well, man. Yeah, we're, we're, we're years behind. Done, Bro, done wait, what, what year are we in? He's we're, 21 Savage British, no? Huh? Yeah. But he's born here, but it doesn't mean he's British. We're like, you know wait, when... Like, I remember you... That's, that's at least one, though. They kind of wouldn't claim that and that yeah, he said yeah, in right, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But America's right. one that we could just say blatantly. There's another one, yeah, that's two. Yeah, he came to England when he was first starting his career. You know what I'm saying? He was living there for three years. Ah, oh, fuck that. They weren't from England, though. <laughs> them, them two was from. Well, them two have got. They came from England. Jay Z did the same thing, basically. Okay. Yeah, like, no, I don't. I don't. I, 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 yeah. oh, okay. But uh, but he's but uh, but he'll be. We could put him in that box. Who? Twenty One Savage. I suppose if you want, but he doesn't speak an English accent neither. Nah, man. Don't that. That's forced. Now I wouldn't do that. Oh. Let him run with the American thing, he's man. He's from here. He's from here. Big up salute. You know what I'm saying? They're from here. But let's not like, yeah, try... Nah, bro. <laughs> yeah. Let's... Because I think... I, I personally feel the, the, the boy Drake shows more love to the UK than, than, than he does. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? He's not from here. He says he's the best artist from his country. Just to, just to mug it. You know what I'm saying? Know, so, Drake. No, 21. No. So, like, I don't know. I wouldn't, I wouldn't do that with 21. But I would say to me, in terms of like... Um, in, in like um, and like some of the young, some of the young ones, I, I just, I just read what they're doing. Like I'm seeing man no, selling off shows. Cause you gotta understand, right? Yeah, no. like there's man that's gonna be bitter, fam. That's hurting their heart. That like, certain man, younger than them, and that, and them man, ever, it's hurt. See to me, I don't give a shit. Cause you know why? I saw where this thing came from. Yeah, man was on and YouTube you and that. Your part, yeah, man was on YouTube and that, brother. And see you know what I'm saying? Just about now, man, are doing mad shows in Paris and other parts of the world and all that. Take this thing further, big. Take it further. I think music as a whole is in a, sp- a place where it, further, it can be taken further if you want, it, you it, if you want to man. do it. Do you know 
you got to say? There's a lot of people you know I mean? still doing really well like, that, 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 that people don't get to see. So yeah. one thing I think about the UK scene is that they try to put everyone's eyes in the same place and yeah. tell you if they're not watching, if you're not watching this se- section of people, then you're missing out. But then you'll meet, you'll find someone and meet them and bro, their following will be crazy and you've never seen them before. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So there's a... Those just, are the ones that are killing still, it. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Those are the ones that are killing it. You know, like they, they, they'll be like, um, like they'll have like, Mad shows, yeah, like regular shows. And some of the guys that are like popping they won't have as much shows than me. If you can, yeah, what's going on here? So, exactly, yeah, it's balanced in it. You know what I'm saying? But you um, go to their Instagram, you see their little uh, streams, the guy again, like they've got a real yeah. following, but no one, you know what I'm saying? It's not, we just everyone's just focused on the mainstream. I think that mainstream thing is dying as well. Mm. So, I feel like, but people, what's mainstream? Mainstream is like the anything that's coming from the labels. That's got a plugger that's connected to the radio. That's got connected to all of these different things that they don't even have to hard, try hard. Cause they're making certain drill tunes ma- mainstream, bro. Yeah. So I, I don't know what what we call it mainstream anymore. When we when we was younger, you couldn't have anything on. No radio. hell no. What um? What do you think is gonna happen when we run out of water? Um, someone I forgot twilight because. Yeah, I'm saying we wee time. Cause even now I need to go t- in a minute, bruv. Drinking bare water, bro. <laughs> I drink bare water a day. I go to toilet on a regular. I mean, on the planet. But dead. They, they, they'll, don't. You think about that? They'll, <laughs> don't. I don't know that water. They'll figure out. They'll figure out some. What you call it, though? And there's ways of um doing condensation. You just gotta leave it for the day. Yeah, condensation. Yeah. <laughs> drinking water and that. I wish you the way yeah, you did that. Yeah, yeah. Just, just do. They ain't running out. See that? Watch up. Yeah, I do. Just do. <laughs> yeah. I see. I see, I see I mean, there's certain things on YouTube where there's running out of water. Nah, mate. That just. Life. Yeah. When he said that, it pulled forth my head. Ah, oh, I got. I got. Leave life yeah, situation. Like, <laughs> you know, like trapped in the water, trapped in the sea for like five days and shit. Yeah. And they've had to do little things to survive. I'm like, right. I didn't even know you could do nah, that. Nah, man, this is, yeah. I just keep that there, but yeah. Yeah, no, seriously, like, where we're at, the state of the world, but. Bro, they're going to make new water, man. These yeah, like, I don't think you should ever focus on things like that. Never. Be all right. It's, it's negative. Running out of oil. What, what we do if we run out of water? Yeah, I'm running out of oil, though. Negative. Running out of oil, though. Run out of oil. We ain't running out of oil. Running out of oil, yeah. We don't need oil in the first place. <laughs> These mm-hmm. times we got air fryers and we got yeah. like electric cars. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> Them electric cars are spooky though. <laughs> you got air fryers, don't need no oil. I like that. Yeah. <laughs> that one, I've never been in an electric car. Yeah, them cars. I've never been in an electric car. See, yeah, I like, I like you that. The cab. No, I haven't. In a cab. But I don't. What cab? You know the sit. The, yeah, the most cabs well, are electric. I've been in a. I haven't. But I've, them cars, they're not paying the payment by driving to the one. Fed station. Right? You been in the cab lately? Say, so, yeah. In the last year? Nah. Oh, okay. You know, that's funny. I don't really, I haven't been that far out. Right Why are the cabs called it? What are they called again? The Prius? There we are. Prius, thank Prius. you. I was looking for the day. Yeah, the Prius. <laughs> the Prius is electric. I might have been in the Prius before. Yeah, they're electric. Yeah, they're electric. But yeah, it might have been in a place, not in this country though. But they're like, remember them, them, them 3G phones that first come out with the, with, with, with the video cam? Yeah, that was yeah, mad, yeah, long. Yeah, mad long. Let's talk about That's it, exactly yeah. what the Priuses are. They're like the first models. Now they got some different drugs. Look at the testers that they got coming you out now. What they did in China. It's just like, yeah. man went to park. Yeah, them up, cars, they're mad. They just came out of parking and went. <laughs> cars, they're well, mad. It, 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 done his, it, it done his, okay. Yeah. It killed people. Yeah. yeah. The car just took off, like whoever was in the car. Can't drive them cars, they are mad, bro. Man put it in park, and it parked, and then just said, nope. Car, they are mad, blood. Can't even press the brakes. How many people did it kill? Two people and injured a couple more. Imagine you're in that car. It's you can't even stop it. You better be praying to God, really, bro. Oh, that's what you got to do. Just be praying to God, because that's the only thing that's left, bro. Mm. There's, there's nothing else left, because you're dead, bro. If, the, if that car don't stop down anytime soon, you're dead, fam. Yeah. Uh, when I saw that, I said, Wee. Yeah, I was like, What? <laughs> it's a wee. Mad. Yeah. Man could just put coordinates in your car. Was he into anything else, perhaps, as a youngster? Like sport? Oh, I used to play football. Foot- football, I see. Yeah, I played football like, um, like, and it's mad. I saw a picture today, big old Reggie Ryan Smith, play for Arsenal and stuff like that. I had to start playing football with him. So I like, I started <laughs> Ryan Smith. Yeah, my school one as well. Did you go to my school? He came to my school later on, but I knew him when I was like in primary school and that. But he came to my school like a bit later on. But so when I started playing football, I'd like um started playing um I was left footed. Skills, mm. my love skills, but yeah. You left handed? 
Nah. So I knew that I must have just like just copy the man's thing, bruv. Because it meant to be left handed and, and left uh, and and and, re- le- and left handed and left footed, innit? But I'm I'm right handed and left footed. So um and my right foot is terrible, bruv. Terrible. Yeah. My left my left foot is techers though, you know what I mean? But um yeah, so I used to like playing football and then as I got older, bruv, fuck, you know. Was you taking it seriously, or was it? Yeah, I used to play like f- my local team, Cape. Wanted to play, we used to play Market Road, or whatnot. I used to play for my school, like. But over the year, not after the years, it just starts. The marijuana and ganja. Things change. Yeah, yeah, okay. Things change. Things change. <laughs> yeah, change. bro. So, uh, but I still love. I still like football now. I still love football. Arsenal, obviously, but. Um, as far as playing, I'm still probably not as that like, healthy as I used to be, but I can still play football though. Football's dangerous playing it these days. I played one time <laughs> with a bad day. Oh gosh. See all the things that you can do back in the day. You know you can play every position. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Next thing you know, now I'm gonna try and take you out. Bro. The ball hit my eye. Eh? <laughs> the eye. eye. <laughs> Boom! For even now I don't think it's fully right. Like yeah. I think it's slightly, you know, like if I if I go to the left <laughs> When you back in the day, you could just firm that and then get it. tomorrow you're playing football again. You see the next day, my whole body as well. I said, nah, football, football, it's dangerous sport for adults to play. I'm not interested, no, yeah. yeah. I football my shit though. I still, I still fuck with football still. I wonder yeah. yeah. Still play it though. I ain't played it in a while. Yeah, that's what. That's the dangerous part. I ain't played it in a while. I mean, get groin strain if I play football. I don't like groin strain, <laughs> so I don't play football. With my shit still. Go get deep heat. Yeah, nah, it's all right. Don't play football. I don't play. Yeah, it's never been my sport. No one will play into, into, into any other sports? Not really, you know. Nah, it's just football and football. That was it. Football. You know, I like basketball. I couldn't play it. Um, <laughs> do look all I'm doing. I'm shooting it like that's. They, it don't. It don't correlate, bro. Basketball's a tall man. Yeah, yeah. There's no tall way. Man sport. So, um, but I can't lie. Like you football. know what, guys? What's what, what I like sports wise? I remember meeting a guy in the, in the States. He got he got them. He started to get, you know the hills? What's hills? Hills, like, mm. hills. Like, to walk and walk and play basketball. And then we took him off. He was short, but he kept playing, 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 playing like that. Yeah, to be able to do that. That's how much he was into the sport. That's mental. Yeah, that was, yeah. yeah it was, I, it was I, like, I like watching basketball. I just, in terms of like playing it. Uh, yeah, but yeah, it must, yeah, I'm not, you know, it's, if it can't come to my brain right now, it must have been not that important. Yeah, yeah, come on. Was 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 it? What's the what's the best thing you've ever seen? The best thing I've ever seen. Mm. Oh, that's a bit of a random question, ain't it? I'm a random kind of guy. The best thing I've ever seen. I don't know. What's the worst thing you ever seen? The worst thing I've ever seen. Um, probably my bridge on the floor like that. Maybe that to that. that, that. Mm. Yeah. Mm, sure. But, yeah. I've seen. Yeah. What happened? You know, do you want to talk about it? If you don't talk about it, you don't I'm not going to talk about it. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. yeah. That's. It's your biggest inspiration? My biggest inspiration? Um, I'll say family. Yeah. Favourite quote? Favourite quote? Um, I don't know, but one of my favorite ones is when it's told a story. I'll be honest with you. Yeah. I'll be honest story. with you, bro. bro I can't knock that. Yeah. <laughs> we just compensated. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. No, but I'm, I'm just saying. I'm, I'm just saying because it's, yeah, it's, it's, reiterate it because of the yeah, conversation because we've had. Yeah. It gives you, like, it gives you a, a sense of mentality where like. No one's gonna give you nothing, bro. You better go and get. No one ain't gonna give you nothing. Mm. If you don't win, you better, you're a catch on the story. You better go and get, bro. Yeah. Cause, tell the story. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's it's kind of harsh. It's a bit like like, but I grew like, and sometimes, and this is what I think kind of helped me because I grew up around a lot of tough love. Mm. So there's none of that sympathy thing going on. Mm, no money cuddling. You have to get on with it. No nah, man, I wasn't doing that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? No, John. Like, no. So you kind of like. So what, how would you, what would you consider yourself? <laughs> I was gonna say. Yeah, What's that? <laughs> you, 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 what was that? Consider myself. Yeah. I would what, say, in the, I would in the say like a loser. No, 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 no way, no, 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 man. Uh, <laughs> you don't start getting those. You don't, don't start getting. Let me no, get no, my. No, 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 no. What I basically mean, right? Yeah, is that for example, like 
it's a narrative, right? And so say for example, um, I might have been I might have been like the weakest link in my in my crew, right? Yeah. And then I've been given this money. And then I start telling the story like I was the main guy in my crew. And da, da, da. <laughs> yeah, you're, you're just, you know what I'm saying? But he, he's told that story and he's lying. But to me, <laughs> like, how I look at it in terms of like, I've played, I've, I've, played, I've, I've made people rap like me. Like, I've, I've, I've put inspiration into the game. I've got some winnings. But, but in terms of where, like, um, winning, I mean, like, in situations and in, in narratives, I'm not really talking about the rap game like that. Because to me, Everyone's one in bare different ways. There's not no king or anything. No, that's my yeah. point. Yeah, so I wasn't. I'm not directly speaking about the rat. I'm speaking just yeah. in life. Uh, I think rats tell the story. Who? <laughs> no, no, no. I'm, 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 no, no, I'm saying. No, I'm saying. No, no, no. I'm saying. Is that going back to my questions? I'm going to quick, quickly move back to my questions. I'm saying just in life because one thing, one thing is like I will say is that yeah, like especially where we're from, bro. Like, there's a lot of this entitlement thing. Do you know what I'm saying? See me? I give glory to God. Yeah, like, I there's, give a, God the glory. there's a lot of entitlement. Not about any of us. Like, there's a lot of entitlement in the, in, the, in the hood, bro. And it's like, that's what's killing our people, bro. Do you know what I'm saying? Like, everyone feels that they deserve this or they deserve that. Do you know what I'm saying? The get, the, one thing I realised about this industry is very, and this is why I'm saying this nonsense, because it's very crooked, it's nasty. Forget about you gotta look at your own life. So but I'm just saying, just in the general, yeah. I'm not better than from this game like that. Like, like, everyone's like. winning looks different as well. Praise to God, bro. That's that's that's, 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 that's farther. Because this, yeah. Everyone's yeah, winning looks different. Course, that's, yeah. that's what I was trying to get through to you. Like some people's winning, they could have been a top winner, but never wanted to speak. You yeah. understand what I'm saying? It doesn't yeah. mean that they're not winner because they don't want to tell the story. No, what I'm trying to say, whether they spoke or not. The narrative has been shown. There's a man from my end, right? He don't ever spoke, but we know he won. He was in the hood, done. He's not, he's not, he's not on no podcast, none of that. But we know he won because he's done what he's done in there and he cut out. Well done. Do you know what I'm saying? So a man ain't got to say anything or say, but he actually won. He he was part of a certain crew. One of them's in jail. A man's gone, um, um, some other smoking and he's and he's caught and he's gone. Yeah, yeah. Go on, salute. In, so in a man in situation ain't got... he won, innit? Yeah, he won. But that, and to other people could say that he didn't win because he don't no one knows his story. You're going too deep into this winners. Uh, you're, you're, you're looking too intricate into it. Maybe I am. Yeah, you're looking a bit too intricate into it. I would just the main the, the main thing what I basically take what I get from that is that um I keep losing you when you lean forward on. Oh sorry, bro. That's all right. Um yeah, my, my main thing what I mean by that, yeah, is that in a situation, right, yeah, like, f like for example, right, Jay, yeah, this is, yeah, this is, this is exactly the same as I mean about the doctor, exactly the film, Dr. Dre thing. We oh, know what oh, kind oh, of, go on, go on. you know what kind of started how the NWA thing kind of started mm -hmm. with Easy and him and there, and then some man died. So, you know, like, instead of man giving the guy the actual flowers and say, like, he might have done this, say, no, nah, I done that, bro. Mm. And that's what I basically mean, it's a narrative. No, I'm saying. That doesn't make you a winner. That's so, wait, 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 I'm saying, the reason why I'm saying is because, yeah, in this industry we're in, right, I'm never going to forget life, industry we're in, right, yeah, it's cold, bro. And it gets to a point where, like, um, a lot of us, our pairs, come up together, right? And a man might be doing certain things and he might have been, yeah, yeah, your understudy coming up. But because he's up there and, what, they might not want to bring, man, no. Get all that. Do your thing and win. Do you know what I'm saying? Because That's I didn't. True. Yeah, do but, but, but I'm just saying, like, do your thing and win. Do you know what I mean? I understand the ethos you're talking yeah, about. Yeah, yeah. 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 Tell the stories. Yeah. Don't expect anything from anyone. Usually, wrongers and people that cappers and people that care for the attention and care for on it's, it's it's ego based. Like anyone that's not ego based will give glory to God. And see, for me, in anything that we do. When you're on the ego base, it's just give give the God the glory, isn't it? Mm. If you're successfully normally you're, and you're good and you're happy, because you can look successful and your your life be shit. Shit. So you know what I'm saying? Facts. What well, if I just highlight that? You know. Yeah, you're no, a winner. I'm not saying I'm not a winner, bro. I, I, if I if I didn't think I was a winner, I wouldn't even use that mentality. Um, when he's told a story, uh, when he's told, I wouldn't even because that roller, I must have lost in my life. I'm jealous of everybody. No, I'm good. Like I'm, mm. I, like I'm, I'm happy. Like, I pr listen, I'm like none of that. But I'm saying just in certain, in certain agendas and narratives, when they will tell the story. Because some people ain't might even be, be about to even tell the story. You know what I'm saying, and when I say tell the story, it's not me. It don't mean come on camera or come or anything. It's a narrative that you've kind of given to the world. If that mm. makes sense, you know what I mean. No, come on. We've never heard the Roman Romans and then man there speak. Bro, 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 bro. 
Cool. Let's. I want to talk. Hey, yeah, because he's got two intro. I'll, I'll basically. Right. Is so the guy you did it again? Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. You can yeah. start again. I want to ask you about the fact that people are too entitled at the yeah. moment, or the younger people feel more entitled. And what you was talking about when you was talking about the entitlement yeah. was that, like, yeah, yeah. I've wanted, I've wanted, I want to rap. I want to. I want to hear about that, and I want yeah. to. I want to hear what you think about that as well. The way yeah. people are living t today. Yeah. What was? What would that? Where did that come from? What do you think about that? Um, like. I've always, like, for example, myself, right, yeah, I don't know, me or people around me, we just went and did what we needed to do or whether it's to get money or whatnot. I was, I was never relying on another person to, like, help me get out of that situation. And now I just feel like, um, like, don't get me wrong, I believe that we are people's and, you know, man, them, whatnot. I just feel a lot of times we've got to a certain stage where, like, people are ungrateful and um, they just want to take, 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 take. Mm -hmm. Do you know what I mean? So like, um, I just feel like we're just like greed. Yeah, we're lot. We're, we're in that. We're in that. Like, and everyone feels like they deserve this. They deserve that. If you deserve it, then you're gonna have it. Do you know what I'm saying? Work hard for it, you'll get. But yeah, man. So I think that I think you're right. I think it's it's a lot right now for me personally. Mm. I think everyone wants or everyone feels like they deserve. Are you taking a picture of me yourself? No, myself. Okay. Mm. Cool. <laughs> anyway, um, I think everyone feels like they deserve, yeah. like, but a lot of people are forgetting that it, we're all coexisting. Yeah, Do you get what I'm saying, like, and that coexistence needs a symbiotic kind of life. You need to, you to help the other, help the other. If there was just one person left, do you know what I mean? But um, I digress. That thing of entitlement, like, that's what's causing the rift between everybody now. Like that's what's causing this. In it's just a lot. Like it's a lot. That's what. The, that's why there's a message there. That's what but people why, care about. Why, why is it happening now, though? <clears throat> materialistic, materialistic. I don't um, think it's always been like that. Um, materialistic desires, the disbanding of the family, the mm. what what you actually understand. Like what we saying before. Like someone to actually when your dad actually being there, not just to, to not mm. to target you, but mm. for you when you was going. Oh, Wayward, maybe if he had the opportunity to come or you had the opportunity to get sent to him, he could have like play gated that. Mm. Some people never had that. So then that's that's could be a factor with what's going on with what's going on now as well. A lot of um people haven't got their parents to give them the right accountability talks when they're young, mm. before it's too late, before it's when you're about to do a robbery or stab someone or something mm. like that. Do you get what I'm saying? There's there's so many things that like, could be said for it. But then like not having to go through a struggle. I, I think not actually understanding what it is to go without. Is, I, I, is I part think, of it. I think um, that plays a major part. Like, not having, not going through a certain struggle and seeing certain things like, boy, I can get that. I'm saying, it's like, did not not knowing what other people have to go through to get what I'm saying. Yeah, even, <clears throat> even going further now, when do we go without? Right now, mm. if you've got P, mm. you don't have to go without anything. Mm. When do you go without now? Oh. If you want something, you can get it. Yeah. If you ain't, if you can't get it here, you jump on a plane and get it somewhere else. Yeah. When do we go without anymore? When do we have to wait? Mm. When to so say them? How much value can you hold on to something that you don't have to necessarily wait for? Yeah. Which is why we got this um, fast food, fast food nation or fast food. You no, know, like they're doing it with. I hate to be soapboxy, but it's just it's coming out now. It's like the the relationships, mm. people's the way they're going on now with relationships, to the way they went on with, bro. Do, do you understand what I'm saying? And it's like that's like that's like on every like talk show podcast and guys are like this, girls are like this. Yeah, I, I, I didn't even got to that bollocks. I even got to that bollocks. I was yeah, go you could talk that. Well, I, yeah, I, no, and that to me is like I understand, cool, but there's a lot that, of other stuff that we can. Do you know what I mean, bruv? You know what it is, right? So we go on this now. I'll close the fucking book. Fucking excuse my French as well. So my thing was first propane, yeah? yeah? It's like, there's this happy meal kind of thing with people dating and stuff, like the Tinder thing, like, yeah. good luck to you, do what you need to do, yeah. you can't get people, whatever. But the Tinder thing and just jumping in and jumping out. Mm. Now, you just enlighten, like, enlighten me to that other further thing where people are now not actually having relationships. They're coming on and saying, oh, I'm an expert about this and I'm an expert about that. Like you say, every relationship is different. Mm. Every human being is different. Mm. Everything you do has to therefore be different. Mm. The fuck are you coming with this funk? For, and people just trying to win arguments and shit. Again, it's mad. It comes down to the people that you see, like uh, that wanna they wanna tell you something because of their experience. Do you get what I'm saying to yeah. you? Like, but then what? So, but they didn't no longer like, experience but that's your experience. Do you get? It? That's Not, what I'm saying. Yeah. That's that's right like, like they, like, because you take, and you take. I could see when you were younger, you weren't good with girl, bro. 
Mm. So when you got older, you became good. If you became mm. rich and you got hench and you got girl, you got you know what I'm saying it's no yeah. problem. But you can say someone that's got he's angry at girls from the past, mm. like still from his young days where they yeah. dumped him out and that. And that's why he's like, and, and he's gonna get them Kevin back. Kevin Samuels like that. <laughs> Kevin Samuels was actually breaking things down, mm. but they tried to put him in the same kind of bracket. But he was just breaking things down. Mm. Until, uh, before a woman woman has to speak bossy before he starts breaking it down mm. she'll start saying no I, I need a man that's a million did it. then he starts saying okay what do you rate yourself then mm. you know the one's there but he wasn't out to just to beat women down so you can see he's a man that could could, could get girl if he wanted to get girl but <laughs> there's certain people that do these things because they they're not really experienced in within um uh it's, yeah, a department. it's a new it's a new fad right it's as far department. as i'm concerned yeah. it's a new fad yeah. and like it's okay, I think it's okay to take advice from someone you may know. As cliche as that may be, it could be bad, it could be wrong or whatever. They like, might give you bad advice or whatever. You know, people are snakes like that are close to you or whatever, yeah. but that sh it should be limited there. And other than that, I think you should just learn for your relationships, learn for your mistakes. And that's how that's what life is supposed to be. Yeah. You can't watch this stuff. That's why so many people are confused there'll, now. There'll be, um, They're trying to apply someone else's thing to this. Like, there'll be like a thing show, what they call a reality show, right? Yeah. yeah. And... Uh, just for example, you, I don't know, uh, I don't know. I'm trying to uh, love no, and first. Like, just give me a little love. There's probably one out there now because <laughs> because I'm giving this example, right? Yeah? Love oh, and nipple, right? Yeah. yeah. So these times there, um, this couple, what this guy, what not, is taking his guy to the to the baddest restaurant every weekend, right? Yeah. Mm. Your man's doing some decent job. You know what I'm saying? You're putting all this, this. This cover guy is getting paid from this doing the show. It's all fake. Mm. You're coming to your man, giving him all these pressures, mm -hmm. and be like, "Oh, you gotta take me there." Da, 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 da. Listen, mate. There's different lifestyles. Yeah, yeah. There's that. Like, so this is why, like, right, like, keep your relationship. Your relationship. Stop watching. Um, and to me, that's for the women. And even no, I'll be real. Keep it your thing. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Because. Mm -hmm. Me and my girl cut you proper. We ain't got to do none of that. Oh, that's, that's, that's. Because I'm not now going to see that, for example, um, like watching a show and some girl might have bought, uh, I don't know, like a, a celebrity girl might have, might have bought her, her man some five bag Louis, Louis jacket. And I'd be like, babes, though, you're not trying to get me that Louis jacket, though. You're not moving proper. What? Different lifestyle. I'm not. I'm not. You know what I'm saying so. Like, so you know, I've watched people in them shows go jail because they're trying to keep up with other men on the shows. <laughs> Do you know? Yeah. Oh, they're trying to see, good on the show, but you gotta get bread now because they're coming to film next week. You're again. just bringing stress into your house for no reason <laughs> for some fake lifestyle that they're seeing on thing like like. Who 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 told who told anyone about who the, what the fuck is a high value man and a yeah. high value woman? The fuck is that? High value man, high value minute, they exist, but I say a high value woman don't make any sense. No, everyone's calling themselves that now. That's that's the they'll say I need this thing, yeah, no, I need that because I'm a high value high woman. Value I need this because I'm a high value. You know what I'm saying? A high value man can get gal, but a high value woman, or what a woman that makes money in that, yeah, that doesn't help her sexual life, fam. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah. as a man, it will help your sexual life if you've got peas. But but see with that one have to look at that with a high value thing as well. See with that that for a man that's got peas and that, yeah. And as as a young boy, yeah, of course, you're going to be trying to just slam boom, body, boom, tum, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, on some, on some, on some shit. But as you get older yeah. and just high value man thing, you're not slapping everything over. You're not. This is you're just not. someone with money. You're just, you're you got money. Not. High value. Because, this, because you're, you're it don't even make no sense affluent. to you. Okay, high value, affluent, yeah, I can take it. It don't even make no sense, to be fair. Like, you just would bear gal, listen that, and bear different. No, nah, I think as a... A high value man? Yeah. Because, I'm like, I, you can't say a high value man or even a high value woman is it, just yeah. to do with money. I wouldn't just say that. I say it's to do with your morals, well, your honor. Okay, yeah. How you carry yourself, how you yeah. deal with people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, because yeah, yeah. You can be like a person that's that's a billionaire, but you're a piece of shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Yeah, I, I stand that's shit. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. That's yeah. what, see, for me, when I'm you're telling people shit. that they're winners, yeah. But like, Jade, hit me up. Look, are you going back to that winner thing? Oh, oh man. It doesn't matter how your position is, your heart, bro. Like you win from your morals. You okay. win from you win from being honourable. Like you can like literally die with that shit. You know, like all the other stuff. You can't like you might have looked good in life, but you sold your soul, bro. I don't think that that's good. I can't sit here and say, oh, it's it, anyone in any position as long as it looks good, it's good. Proper. Yeah. I need the uh, socials for you, please. We have got to talk about what's coming out late. What's coming out now? What um, we got coming out now? I've been recording, but I ain't I ain't put no nothing's like, coming um, out. Let's get your socials, please, for the people um, at home. Yeah, official official. Propane, that's on that's what everything basically. Which propane yeah. don't catch fire. Yeah, come on. Um don't that's that's for everything. That's that's my Twitter, my Instagram, 
Mm. Official YouTube, propane. Official propane, yeah. And my YouTube is uh, propane prolific, I think. Propane. Is it, are they linked? Yeah, if you got all my YouTube, it's all, it's all there. Oh. I mean, if you got my Instagram, it's all there. It's all there, yeah. Propane, you got any questions for me before we wrap up? First part on the camera. Mm -hmm. I'm going to tell the story. Am I the winner? Are you the winner? I'm, I'm just go, joking. Go. I'm just joking. Go. Yeah. <laughs> Would you want to hear any questions? Yeah, but you got to understand though, Jay. Like, like. <laughs> She's going to ask you a question. No, 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 no. <laughs> on some real shit. Now do you see? Now do you on see? On some real shit. He's looked at it a bit more different. Cause I don't know. I don't know why, 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 even, why he thought, but he's a person still telling his story. Mm. No, I know that as well. So there's that. So I'm not so, for me. But I'm, 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 but, I'm, but, how many podcasts? But, I could be but, doing what everyone else is doing. No, but I'm just saying, the though, podcast, right? Yeah? Setting a different narrative and all of that. But, but, but I'm just saying, like, that's one person that's 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 um, still telling your story. Yeah, yeah? yeah. What I mean by that, rappers winning to there's men that are probably whether they're in jail yeah. or working a normal job that call this thing a day. They've no, got no I'm more voice saying, anymore, right? Yeah. So a man might be running with this thing. If he's someone, telling if his someone, story. If someone strategically you, leaves you out, you got to remember, you even you're one of them. Yeah, I know you're, that. They, they've, they strategically leave out certain key people when they're talking about certain things, yeah? yeah? Cool, but I'm not going to say that, make them, yeah. make them a winner from that. Yeah. yeah. No, I'm still telling my story. I ain't done yet. My that's thing ain't that's over not yet. how, they see that same audience that we're talking about, that's yeah. the story's been told to. Yeah. That's not, if we care about how they see things, yeah. then they could, they could potentially say, you, what did you do? You didn't do nothing. And that's why I say the winning talk. Because you know what? There's another thing I go like, I love as well. The Gabos one. The game ain't based on sympathy. Black. One more time. The game ain't based on sympathy. The game? Ain't based on sympathy. The game ain't based on sympathy. Gabos. Thank you very much, Gabo. That was it's live talk. We got propane. Like the voice behind Gabo. the camera, the wizard. Wow. Yeah. And me, I.O. Fowley. Yeah. Propane, it's Actually, been a pleasure, bro. Yeah, I'm about to say. <laughs>